Welcome to Drombat, the show where we challenge each other in the bloodstained arena of art combat. I'm Caldwell. I'm Nathan. And today we are doing the inverse black light challenge, which means as opposed to in negative space. Yes. We're using it's the it's the only erase challenge. Mm -hmm. That's right. As opposed so to not erasing, we are only erasing. Yeah, we can't unerase mm -hmm. what we've already erased. Yeah. Uh, we can't use the 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 black uh, pen no. to to re re blackenate the area. Can't do that. So don't, don't and, even try. Uh, uh, mm -hmm. Prox Escape. Mm -hmm. Who also famously suggested the the mouse challenge was the the author of this challenge as well. Prox Escape, big. Is this a two fur or a three fur? Is this is Prox Escape earned a turkey? Uh, I don't know. Did Prox Escape do another another one? Prox Escape is those these two. He's just always suggesting great ideas. It's a great mm -hmm. it's a great suggester. I like it. Thank you, Prox Escape. We've uh, we've embarrassed him in front of the class. Uh huh. Now everyone knows. Now he'll never the, submit again. The teacher's and pet. then then you know a lesson a lesson is learned. Yeah, we've, uh, <laughs> we've ruined him. He'll never get invited to the cool kids' pool party. <laughs> the rich kid whose parents always I go wish. out of town on Man. business trips. <laughs> and they have a pool party. And they have well, the kid throws the pool it's party the kid because it... the the parents are out of. What are you drawing? The by the way, what do you, mean? <laughs> you just you just started going and uh, I. Um, I'm drawing the spookiest. The spookiest. Just the spookiest. You okay? Yeah. Sure. <laughs> you know. I. I you know when you you go it, like. It is pretty spooky. Those those look like teeth. You know when you you and go maybe eyes. Uh huh. In like a dark cellar or something, and you hear you feel like a a shiver, and you're like, what was that? It That's, sends it spins your your spine all all a quiver. That's the spookiest. That's the spookiest. Uh huh. It's, check it, check it out. Um, hit. It's gonna be on <laughs> bookshelves. Uh, Co-writer Stephen King, uh, the spookiest. This is uh, that's the bad guy from uh, from Naruto. You're drawing. Am I? I don't. Uh, Did I draw a Hokage? Uh, is that what's happening? A Ro Rochi. Mar I didn't watch it. I drew one. Did I draw one of the Dark Clans? You. Drew, I mean, it looks like he's got like a little mm -hmm. ninja band mm -hmm. above his eyes. Nathan, I'm gonna I'm gonna shoot you straight right now. Okay. I only got about like three hours of sleep last night. So this is basically like when really? I close this my eyes. Yeah. When see. I close my eyes, this is what's <laughs> that's Yeah, this oh is no. what's happening. Uh-huh. It's when I don't get enough sleep, I just you know <laughs> go to I sleep. just I just go to <laughs> sleep. You're, you're seeing nightmare things. Uh-huh. And it's it's always telling me like fall asleep, uh come join me in the in the twilight glade. Alright. Uh do you wanna do you want to fix this? Do I want to fix it? How do I? Well, it's, I don't know. We want to make it the spookiest. Okay. Because normally <laughs> what I would do is uh -huh. I, would, I would take what you drew and shrink it. Yeah. But I... You can't do that. Well, I, I could, and then I would just have to real quick blacken in around it. No, don't do it. I think what you should do... I should just take it. You should I should just, just go. take it take and go with it. Uh -huh. Okay. This, like, find... Find a way to ruin it. Okay. Mm -hmm. Sure, sure, sure. No. But yes. Sure. Okay. So yeah, um, as I was saying, as you were saying, whenever I close my eyes, you see this, this facade greets me. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Um, yeah, it's, Prox Escape is good at suggesting challenges for us, but they don't end up being very uh, drombatative, I suppose. <laughs> yeah. Well, uh, yeah, they were, we're battling our inner our inner demons. I would say. We're battling. Um, uh, what, is, what is this guy? This is the spookiest, which He's is the, you know, the man that, so, that visits so me every night. So I'm just gonna mm -hmm. give him some like, uh, like little Ooh. little faces. Oh, nice! Coming out of his big yeah, face. that is that is spookier. Like a little like. Because like, here's the thing, Nate. There's a lot of spooks out there. Okay. And there's some spookiers. Sure. And there's some, uh, you know, decently spookies. But this right. is the spookiest. Um, and it's goddamn, it's my life. It's, it's half of my life is just staring at this guy. You know, I, mm -hmm. I learned that, yeah. uh, that you, you shouldn't call someone a spook. It's true. That's, uh. <laughs> Unless they are legit, like, a, a demon or a, a specter. Or a, or a, or an agent, like a federal agent. Right. But, uh, it's also a racist term. As we, you know, <laughs> we're just really like knocking them off the we're list. We're just getting so don't don't say that. Don't say unless that. You're talking about ghosts. Unless you want, or unless you're a racist and you want to, you know, want want to let people know what it. Uh, what if you're a ghost racist? 
Is there a racial slur for ghosts? Is the question I Cause, want. Because yeah, it's, <laughs> not, it's not here. spooks, because it's, no. already, uh, it's mm-hmm. already a racial... Uh, so, uh, is... Hmm. Uh, maybe, like... Is, is it whiteies? No, we're not... <laughs> <laughs> Well, there's so many great words for ghost, but like, what's the one that means like I, I, I don't want these, I don't um, want these blankets in my town. These blankets, yeah. You call them blanket. Yeah. Call them, call blankies. Them blankies. Blank- <laughs> these damn sounds, blankies. These damn blankies. These was, damn. That was a that was an uh, off Broadway play. It was <laughs> loosely based off of damn Yankees. Except Aaron instead Blanky, of yeah. it being, uh, he trades his his soul to the devil for uh-huh. for baseball talent. He just <laughs> he just uh, is, what does he do? He's very angry at. Uh, he just trades his life to be a ghost, which I guess is what everyone does. Everyone has that ability. That's everyone's superpower, really, when you think about it. <laughs> so blankies. Everyone's superpower is you can die. I do. At, <laughs> at some point. That's like. <laughs> It's like, well, that's true. Hey, you, you might. Life hack. <laughs> life hack. Yeah, Don't little, live. A little, uh, little etch, etching because oh, we, yeah. we can. This is like, I want to get this um, blown up and put on like a black light poster for my, for my man cave. For Caldwell's <laughs> man cave. <laughs> Uh-huh. Guys, don't uh, don't knock it till you've been there. Caldwell has has quite it's the, an actu- the quite thing is, the cave of men. Uh huh. It's an actual cave. It's like uh, it's like the cave of wonders it's less in of a uh, man cave. in Aladdin. It's less of a man cave and more of a dude grotto, I would say. <laughs> um, it's just give really him, really dank. Give him some and not nice, from like, weed. I mean, from like you know all the molds growing there. Sure. Oh, what's this? Oh, he's got little jaunty feet. Yeah, because you really, you've given he's the spookiest. Because look, his uh-huh. head—it's just a giant head with little feet. Yeah, that is and like he's got little little heads come out one side of him, mm-hmm. but on the other side. On the other side, uh, are you saying it's asynchronous? Yeah. Are you saying that that is to me as someone who admires good design? That is the spookiest. Uh, I don't just, like asynchronous stuff. I don't like when it's uh, asymmetrical. I think is more the word. Yeah, I don't know what uh, asynchronous means. I do. Uh, that means like off. Uh, not off Broadway. Yes. Uh, I mean, like, uh, uh, this idea is a little too off Broadway for me. I like how you've given it a more cartoony vibe, but still, it is very terrifying. Yeah, I, you know, I wanted mm-hmm. to, uh, I wanted to maintain the in- integrity of it. Let me give him a, like mm-hmm. a pirate leg. Oh, good. Because <laughs> pirate leg, that's a great. Um, because like great trick. they they hobble over there, and also you don't have to draw toes. And also, yeah, you you saw what happened when I drew toes on this one. I like. Let's. You want to zoom this bad boy out? Let's see what that looks Ooh, like. Ooh, there he is. It Ooh, looks there. basically like what you drew, but <laughs> I added some stuff to it. Yeah, there's old Jonathan Spookiest. <laughs> old old Johnny Spooks. <laughs> Randall Spookiest. What would his, what would his first name be? What is the name of this this specter? Um, I like I like Johnny. I like Randall. Um, uh, maybe more. What like about J- Jandal? Jameson. Jameson Spookiest. Jameson Spookiest. There you go. That's the name of this horror. That um, I'm sorry that you've had to watch it. If you watch to the end of this video, it means that you will see this every night when you go to bed. It's kind of like a a ring deal or ring goo, if you prefer the original version. Rango. Ring, yes. Ra- <laughs> Rango is the, sequel the, the original ring. was <laughs> Rango starring it goes, Johnny it Depp. It goes Ringu, which is the Japanese version. Ring, Ring Two, and then Rango. That's and then the, Rango. Mm-hmm. Okay, that's the expanded. That's the full continuity. That's the full universe. That's yeah. canon. <laughs> so um, canon. Well, this has been Drombat. <laughs> uh, thank you so much for delving into the the deep deep terrors that uh, live inside of all of us. Um, please leave suggestions for new challenges for us and uh, subscribe, like, and we'll see you tomorrow. Thanks again, and as always, we're very, very sorry.